Hello, I'm Spastastic. Welcome to Spastastic TV. Today we're going to be looking at this 11-piece camping tool set from Ozark Trail. Mmm, get you some glare going right there. But since we're standing here and talking about it, it'd be boring. Let's go ahead and start it down on the TV dinner trail. Let's just do an unboxing. This isn't a testing video. This is just an unboxing. Testing will be in the future. So, uh, jump cut. All right, so you can't really see it standing up because we got glare from overhead lights, freaking studio lights, and all that fun stuff. But in order to open it, I'm going to get my little trusty little Harbor Freight little mini uh, razor knife. But anyhow, let's lay her down, cut the, cut, cut the little things that I normally cut before I freaking start recording because I'm an idiot. Um, no, that's not what I want. Cut, 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 cut. And you don't normally see me in these types of videos. But that's okay. We can go ahead and set that down and then I can probably lose one of the carabiners this time. By... What the hell just flew out? Something just went flying. Well, it doesn't look like anything that was anything that I wanted went flying. So, uh, first things first, we got a sharpening stone right here that feels like a bag of smashed assholes. It really actually isn't that. It, it's pretty rough. And one side is a little smoother than the other, but the sharpening stone's a little rough. But we're gonna go right to the money maker right here, right to the mini machete. Ooh. Which saw back stainless steel. Pretty ergonomic little handle with a little topography, a little bit of thing on a, on a design thing going right there if it'll focus. But yeah, this one actually feels lighter than the other one that I have, which I do, which I did a 12 piece one card up in the corner of the screen. Um, they had a little bit of a different handle than this, and I think it was might have been a little bit bigger. But yeah, this feels a little lighter than that one did, but all in all, feels really good in the hand. Saw back. Um, there's a little bit of a drawback to a saw back on a stainless steel knife, but I'm going to talk about that when I grab the saw now is it is it bendy it is bendy is it sharp it's very sharp it's got a lock back on it so you can close it in this very very cheap abs construction i do like the fact that it actually has a little stainless steel backer right here but this is a better guarantee of a carbon steel blade and that's actually a way better blade than a stainless steel blade for a saw because well carbon steel is more of a, well, less abrasion resistant it's a lot stiffer and it's a lot heavier duty it just rusts but I do want to talk about this. It claims to be real 550 paracord. Walmart does not sell 550 paracord. They sell something that resembles 550 paracord, but has a breaking strength of 110 pounds. So I can say this is a 550 pound breaking strength, 50 foot roll of 550 paracord all at once, but I'm only going to trust it up to 110 pounds, which is more than what I'd need. You have your batteries for a uh, little Silicon Cobb LED flashlight which I will test here in a minute. Um, you have your cheapo, crappy headband light that, let's see here, it's got a little rubber band on it to keep you from opening it. There we go. There, I can, I can use that right there. And I'll be, and I'm gonna be honest with you, it's shining right in my face and it really isn't that bright. But, nice for hands-free use. You got your two uh, not for climbing carabiners. They say not for climbing right on them. They say that they have a 60 pound break is the 60 pound strength and I'll believe that you got batteries for it and sorry about the uh, heater turning on in the background there's nothing I could do about that other than a jump cut but there's this little freaking oh god I about cut myself with that flip the little thing off the end of it you have the little stone wash stainless steel knife right here which is uh, appears to be full tang is it sharp yes it is very sharp if I slid my finger up that I'd be bleeding and uh, it says it has a sheath in here for the sawback machete. Like, oh yeah, you got a sheath for it right here. You got a sheath, not for the machete, but for the for, for that knife right here. It's got a belt clip on it and a ferro rod, which I'm not going to test right now because I'll test that when I actually test the kit, which I might get a little creative, grab a tarp and uh, a couple of my camping stuff and actually go camping with it. So look for that in the future. But anyhow, I'm Spastastic, you're watching Spastastic TV, and that is the 11-piece uh, Ozark Trail freaking uh, camping tool set. But, well, wait, before we go, gotta test the flashlight, so jump. All right, I gotta be a little bit quiet because I'm right next to the microphone, but it's just a single-use little 50 lumen flashlight. It does not compare to the one that came in the 12-piece set. But anyhow, I'm Spastastic, you're watching Spastastic TV, and thank you for watching. Please hit the like button down below. It probably glowed. But anyhow, thanks for watching.